So I'm really excited, and uh, I thought we might as well jump right into it. And uh, I don't know. I'm thinking maybe let me show you the th how about the three most important things you can do on the guitar to be successful. I mean the three things that if you do them, that's it. You're set. Um, well, let's do that next video blog, okay? <laughs> Today, I'd like to just start off with the real basics. One of my favorite subjects, and that's rhythm. Rhythm guitar, yes. I know guitar players everywhere right now are rejoicing. Yes, rhythm. Um, but in actual fact, uh, my night on stage is um, divided up into taking some solos, but the majority of it is dedicated to being an accompanist, uh, uh, comping for people, and that involves playing chords and playing rhythm. So that's what we're going to talk about, some rhythm. <clears throat> Okay, so this is something I call finding the 16th and all it is really is just putting on a groove or you can use a metronome or if you can do this with your drummer, if you're just kind of jamming together, it's kind of a, a fun thing. Could be a fun thing, could be, uh, well, depends on your drummer, I guess. But anyway, um, my drummer here is right here, kind of a slowed down uh, Billy Jean groove, I guess. And I'm just going to scratch 16 notes with this groove. It's like one, two, three, four. Just kind of getting a feel for it. And I'm going to start to, uh, I'm going to start to play the, the down beats, right? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'm going to try and hit the second 16th now. So if you can name that tune, then you'll win a very special uh, all expense paid trip over here to Singapore uh, to meet me right here in my, my little home studio and uh, we can jam together. Okay? So um, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But uh, <clears throat> that is one of my favorite funk tunes. It's a great rhythm part. Uh, it's one of the things that inspired me to want to wanna play music when I first heard it. So. We'll talk more about that next time. I thought we could do like a, maybe a top 10 list. Top 10, well, 10 is maybe a lot. How about five? We can call it the Funky Five. Next time I'd like to share with you my five favorite uh, grooves, or guitar parts that, um, you know, influenced me, uh, turned me on to music, just got me excited about guitar. And um, yeah, I think we'll do that next time. So thank you so much for clicking uh, on my Facebook page. And if you want to get in touch with me personally, there'll be some details following. Thank you so much.